Our research team has uh, been working up in Alaska for uh, five years, a, a collaboration between Florida State and the University of Alaska at Fairbanks. So we're announcing a new dinosaur. Uh, it's called Ugru Nalik Kukpakensis. Uh, it's named after the Inupiat words uh, for uh, ancient grazer of the Colville River. Uh, and uh, it's obviously very exciting to us to, to find a new dinosaur, and uh, particularly in the Arctic, where this is an animal that uh, generally walked on its back legs, it hey, could drop down on its forelegs. Uh, it was a grazer, had a big broad bill, could graze low-lying plants, and it had uh, batteries of teeth where it had probably up to 1,400 teeth that it, it in, a, in a very horse-like manner, could grind up plants. It was a scaly creature. We know this from uh, close relatives of it, uh, where we found very nice skin impressions, and it also had uh, sort of Godzilla-like plates coming off of its back as well, obviously for display. The bones we're finding from this new animal uh, range from sizes about like this. This is one of the forearm bones here. This animal would have had a jaw about this long, so we're getting very small dinosaurs up there. But occasionally we're finding some larger bones, such as this equivalent element here, uh, which would have gone to with an animal with a jaw about this big. So we're getting animals that are very young to near adult size. And uh, from these adult animals in particular, we're we've found some, some new features that show that this is definitely a new species. Uh, there's a whole different province of dinosaurs up there. In fact, uh, we believe there's 13 different species of dinosaur up there. And uh, just about every single one of them looks a little bit off relative to dinosaurs that lived at the same time down in Alberta and Montana. Uh, and so this has led us to uh, posit in a, a theory that everything up there it w w was Arctic adapted. And this suggests that there was an Arctic province. Uh, basically, there's, uh, what we think we're finding is a lost world, uh, a lost world of dinosaurs out there that, that, that we just r didn't realize that existed. Uh, what's even more exciting to me is that Alaska is almost completely unexplored and we're one of the only research teams in Alaska you know, that's, that's working up there. And it's, it's, it's really exciting, uh, you know, not only what we found, but I think what we're going to find down the road.